would it surprise you to learn that this cat breed is a favorite of long-haul truck drivers? A lot of people don't associate cats with traveling, but the American Bobtail actually travels really well if you introduce it to cars early in its life. And that's not all. Their people-loving attitude makes them useful for more than just companionship. They're actually used as psychotherapy cats because they're very sensitive to people who are experiencing stress. This combination of sensitivity and a unique look has made the American Bobtail one of the most sought-after feline breeds. The American Bobtail is a fairly new breed and they're in high demand, so the wait list is very long to get them. A new breed indeed. The American Bobtail first originated in the United States sometime in the 1960s. There was an Iowa couple that was vacationing in Arizona on an Indian reservation and they found this cat, Yodi, with a bobtail. The couple adopted the unique feline and brought it home, where it romanced the family cat. The kittens they produced and their subsequent offspring all shared Yodi's short tail, making him the patriarch of the breed. And that tail is the American Bobtail's most predominant feature. No two tails in the breed are exactly the same. The average length is between one and four inches. This is just a mutation. This is not like certain breeds of dogs where their tails are oftentimes docked. This cat is born this way. Unlike most cats' coats, the American Bobtail's coat is non-specific in pattern, color, and length. The cat can come in many different forms, different colors, you know, long head, short head. And like a bobcat, the American Bobtail's hind legs are slightly longer than their front legs. So they kind of stand a little slanted. Even though they possess an almost wild appearance, they are very domesticated, perhaps more than most cats. They're really smart. They're like the Harry Houdini of cats. I mean, they can get out of any kind of situation. Despite their ability to escape, the American bobtail is more likely to love you than leave you. Energetically, they bond with humans in a way that we don't really understand. One person who might be able to explain that bond is Ashley Force Hood, one of the most popular female race car drivers of all time. Ashley competes in the NHRA Funny Car Division alongside her father, racing legend John Force. <laughs> Shortly after Ashley got married, her husband surprised her with her first cat, Simba. A little over a year later, we wanted to get him a friend. We thought he was lonely, he needed a buddy. Enter Gizmo. But because they both traveled half the year with their race team, they didn't want to have to be away from their new kitten for an extended period. So we thought, let's just try to take him with us. And ever since, these two American bobtail cats have traveled with Ashley and Dan to the majority of her races. I think because we brought them around the races when they were pretty young, we've really kind of gotten into a routine. On race day, the cats are treated to a home away from home inside Ashley's trailer. There, she sets them up with many of the amenities they're used to in their everyday life. It's kind of become the joke around my job in racing that I've become the cat lady. I'm always talking about my cats. I'm always pulling out pictures. There's Ashley and her husband, Danny. Simba and Gizmo. But just because the cats were okay with life on the road doesn't mean everyone else was. How would the 12 guys keeping Ashley's car fine-tuned feel about their new feline travel partners? Are they in the pits with two American bobtails? Find out when Cats 101 continues.